Veteran actor Dick Van Patten, best known by many as a TV dad of the 1970s, has died at the age of 86. CBS 2's Jill Nicolini has a look back now on his life and his career. And you could use the exercise. Oh, no, no. I get plenty of exercise. Just watch how vigorously my, my head revolves around my neck. Hey, Dad! He was best known for his role on Eight is Enough. Dick Van Patten played a quirky newspaper columnist called Tom Bradford. He starred in the show from 1977 to 1981, but he began his career right here in New York. Dick was actually a New Yorker. He got started on the Broadway stage, and for him, it was at the young age of seven. He went on to star in almost 30 different Broadway shows and many other TV shows. He appeared on Happy Days, Sanford and Son, and was a regular on the Love Boat for over six years. Well, does that mean that you decided? That's right, Charlie. Dick Van Patten also had a film career, and he must have been very close friends with Mel Brooks because he starred in three of his movies, Spaceballs, High Anxiety, and Robin Hood, Men in Tights. You know, really funny characters. In his later life, Dick actually made appearances on several really hot shows, including Hot in Cleveland, Arrested Development, The 70s Show. I didn't realize that he also has a line of pet food and like organic dog and cat treats. And he was uh, a good actor. He was in a lot of different roles and he'll be missed by the acting community. Actually, eight is the knob is the reason my wife and I only have two kids. I'll remember him fondly from when I was a kid. Van Patten is survived by his wife of 60 years, actress Pat Van Patten. The couple has three sons. Jill Nicolini, CBS 2 News.